All right, you guys, I'm starting from all the way at the back of the attic. So we got an eight inch supply that goes back to the addition. Uh, this runs, all the insulation's ripped off. Goes back to this box that says you guys next to no airflow um, in the addition, and this is why. I mean, this, this should just be capped off and put another, either a window unit or a mini split into that room. There's just, there's never gonna be airflow. It's just too far away from the system to get any kind of airflow. You'd have to run a, a hard pipe trunk line down and run it all the way back to here. And then you can get into some flex, but uh, there's no way of getting good airflow into that with what we currently, the current situation. I mean, you could probably run something right across here. And then, that, I mean, that may have to be a 10 inch run, all insulated and coming into there uh, to that uh, duct that's back there for the addition, but it's still not gonna be great. And then uh, we come up to the box. We got, the box has basically four taps off of it, three six inch runs and one eight inch. Um, not the greatest airflow on any of these guys. Looks like that one was there. I don't know what this stuff's doing. But, uh, so we got those two, an eight and then a six. And what's feeding that is a 10 or a 12 i think it's just a 10. so we would be yeah so this is a 10 or 12 and then the other issue we got going on is this one over here could be pulled tighter that one actually does have decent airflow for them uh, we're missing insulation on this guy, so we're losing a bunch of cooling out of this. And then we get back to the unit. This one actually is disconnected. This is a 12 that runs below here. We got a 12 coming up. That's hitting another box, I'm branching off and hitting the back side of the house. We got one, two that come off of here. This one's kind of a long run. That one's a short run that could be pulled tighter. Um, this one's a, a short run, but we got box to box. I mean, it's just all done wrong. Um, I think if we at least got this reconnected the right way, that would help a little bit, but ain't gonna do a whole lot. And then uh, Randy had a pretty high static pressure just right at the coil. so. You know, we may look at doing something right at that supply plenum too, but uh, yeah, definitely got some issues here that need to be addressed. I don't know if it's the cause of the breaker. I mean, the compressor going out, but I uh, got some pretty bad airflow.